Making some progress on the wiring. Well, you're not on the website anymore. Go back. <laughs> so we're using this website here, I'm gonna put in the description. Uh, anyhow, we're tracing the wires back from the PCM using continuity and then making sure we got the right wire for each one. Some are coming out of that long snake, uh, like the VSS and uh, some other ones. Uh, high fan, all that good stuff. That was actually one of the C connectors. Uh, but anyhow, tracing them all, tacking onto the wires we need and cutting out the other ones we don't. So following along with this, just kind of got to get an understanding of your brain of how this works and uh, you can make progress from there. So. Alright, so I just got everything bolted up for the very first time. Everything lines up pretty good. Got the front two bolts in. This is my transmission support that I made that bolts into the floorboard. So I'll show you that real quick. Comes right into the floorboard on both sides. I plate the fastener that over the top. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, that, that basically locks into this uh, bead of the unibody or pinch well, whatever you want to call it. Um, here's my uh, cross member or rear differential support uh, that the RX-8 has that swings back on the differential. Uh, I've created a mount here on my transmission support and that bolts in there. That bolt there should hold it nicely. Um, and yeah, that's that. So it lined up pretty good. Pretty happy with that. Come show you the front. Got the wiring harness on. Had to put the transmission uh, connector on before I bolted it to the back because it was so tight. Um, there you go, there's my mounts. Everything lined up pretty decently. Um, steering rack sway bar in there, all been relocated. Actually really did a different job than a lot of people do, really changed it up. Um, anyhow, so it's coming along, getting to the wiring part. This is when the project really comes together. So. I'm going at it.